This is where I had the strawberries here. None left now. Hey, my, what is that? I work here. What do you want? There's so many good ones here. Good morning. Hello. Today we have a special guest. She doesn't know Lucas is here with us today. So we're going to have a big surprise for her. Stay tuned, guys. Let's surprise her. See ya in a Bye. bit. Hello. Hi. We have surprise for you. Strawberry picking today? Yes. Surprise. Oh. Oh. Lucas. I'm here. Oh my go? gosh. Is it actually you? <laughs> it's me. Are you surprised today, Annie? I am. All right, let's go, guys. Hello! We are inside the car right now. Trusty driver Mai again. I'm not driving anymore. We are going strawberry picking. Strawberry picking! Strawberry fields forever. <laughs> Yay! Excited! Does anyone like strawberries? Yeah. Yeah? You like strawberries? How about you, Annie? I like it. We're gonna pick a lot of strawberries. I'm gonna share with you guys too. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. Let's hope those have don't have hepatitis. Okay, yeah, there's an outbreak right now, but no, I don't think so. That's why we go there to pick organic strawberries. Yeah, those are the exact ones that had hepatitis. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean? No, 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 no. Uh, it was on the news at some stores. They recalled strawberries because they had some bacteria on it or something. Stay tuned, guys. We're on our way, passing through. Zeke Bridge. The official name of this bridge is Leonard Zakem Bunker Hill Memorial Bridge. It was named after Boston Civic leader Leonard Zakem and the American soldiers who fought in the Battle of Bunker Hill during the American Revolution War against the British. And TD Garden on the right. That's where basketball and ice hockey in the winter is happening. Leaving Boston on our way to Worcester. See Prudential Tower. Straight ahead, it's now disappearing. So we basically went into Boston to get out of Boston. Yes. Yeah. Are you having fun back there, Annie? <laughs> Hello, again. So we're on the way to Tuga's Strawberry Farm. Today is going to be the first day that they have strawberry picking. What are you going to do with the strawberries? What am I going to do with the strawberry? Eat them, I guess. Do you want to make jelly? It's a lot of work just to spread it on like a piece of bread. I tried it. It. it turned out good, but it a lot of stirring on the pot, a lot of stuff to clean up, especially because it's sticky afterward. So you just prefer buying jelly? I don't even eat jelly. So we're on the highway right now to Tugas Strawberry Farm. I'm in the car with my her driver, and she has a, a ukulele car ornament thingy. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a ukulele. <laughs> Solar panels here. Not too efficient today because it's pretty cloudy. It was raining previously, but now it's not anymore. So we're now pretty close to Worcester, which is actually the second largest city in the state of Massachusetts. But we're not going going in there. That will be this exit, I guess. We're going to the Strawberry Farm. Is our trusty driver loving the American highway system? Not really. Everybody here goes at their own random speed on all lanes. So in Germany, when you're driving on the highway and you're going slower than the rest of the cars, you take the right lane, just like trucks. Go a little bit faster, take the middle lane. Go very fast, take the left lane. So if you want to take an exit, there's not going to be somebody speeding past you from the right lane. We're going to be there in six in five minutes so i think the way that it works is you pay for a plastic bag that you get at the front and then you can fill it up and take it home i can fill up my backpack to sneak them out mine's actually worried that all the strawberries might already be gone they open like on wednesday so i'm worried i might pick up all of that they open on wednesday Today is the first day of the weekend. Who goes Wait. strawberry picking on a Wednesday? I don't know, I'm worried. How about you, Annie? You worried? I'm worried. I'm not too worried. I feel like if they want us to keep coming back, they're probably gonna keep certain sections closed off to the public so that whatever the strawberries keep growing and people can come back and pick them. That makes sense. 
make sense. Otherwise, it would be a two-day attraction. So here's the sign of North Borough. That's where the farm is located. So you guys notice on the far on the sign they write North Borough in the short way they write B O R O. It's actually Borough B O R O U G H, but that's too long for the sign. It seems. Looking at the map, you can see that North Borough is located in central Massachusetts. It took us about 45 to 50 minutes to get there from Boston area. And many documentations show that the first group of residents who used to live here was a group of Native Americans and they were called the Nipmuc people. It's funny that there's a Northboro, Southboro, Westboro, but no Eastboro. And there's a Middleboro too, but it's not near the other three towns which are all near Marlboro. Interesting. Apply there, Lucas. The sign took his family farm hiring. My wants me to work here. So this is a street. There's actually houses left and right. People living kind of remote, but it seems to be quiet. There, they got their mailboxes right on the street. We made it. There's a oh my god. There's a lot of cars here. Oh. Can I drive straight to strawberries? Yeah, drive straight to strawberries. Actually, park on the grass. See you guys on the farm. Hello. We are here. Pick your own strawberries. Are you excited, Annie? Yes. Let's go pick strawberries. I'm kind of worried that like they're gonna pick out all of our strawberries. I think I, I think I scared Maya yesterday when I said we have to be there. Yeah. <laughs> strawberries. You tell me at 11:30 p.m. Hey, we're going strawberry picking tomorrow at 7:30. What's yeah. The, what's the first thing that I said? I said no. <laughs> no, they're gonna pick. Look at them. They're gonna pick all the strawberries. It's okay. Then okay, we're gonna go to the restroom really quick. See ya. No, no, no camera. Oh, and actually, you're supposed to sing this song when you wash your hands, Annie. When you walk out, make sure you sing this song. Okay. Oh, there's the chipmunks. Actually, the chicken. Oh, there's a chicken. And there's, oh, a, there's a farm. I'm gonna go inside right now, guys. Stay tuned. Wait, guys, we found those cute animals over there. Mai, Mai gets distracted very easily. I went to see penguins yesterday. Penguins? At the aquarium with my oh. friend. Animals again. That's not a penguin. I know so, that. So cute. Is it llama? I have no food to give them, though. Hey, hi, Mai. Hey, Mai, what is that? Hello. Is it a llama or an alpaca? I don't know. Try to pet it. No, it's not gonna bite, but maybe spit. No, don't spit at me. Oh, it has teeth. It has teeth. <laughs> yeah. I mean, no, I mean the teeth. I mean, like, mm. <laughs> of course it has teeth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it has a blue eye and an orange eye. Really? Uh oh, it's there's someone exploiting. trying to escape. Where are you going? I love their little place. Yeah, very nice for a ghost. Okay. you, baby? Probably that's why she got her, her head out. Uh oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oops. Uh oh, here we go. <laughs> Baby? Aww. Hello. Cute. Aww. Aww. Don't cough. <laughs> they have playground areas for kids too. Hey, let's go buy some tickets for strawberries, guys. One quart, two quarts, four quarts. Which one are you gonna pick, Annie? Two quarts box? I'm picking a two quart box so I can share it with my parents. Some for me. I think I'm gonna pick one too. I'm gonna share with my mom. I'm gonna share with you guys too. $18. And, and I'm gonna get one too because that's what you have to pay anyway. Cool, we can share. Caring is sharing. Sharing is caring. Sharing, sharing is, is caring. We have to wear wristband before entering so we have one. <laughs> Put them all together and then we And it's gonna... trickling. Here, look. Just got out of the hospital. <laughs> Feels like a hospital van. <laughs> yes. So everyone gets one? Yep, so everyone get one. All right, let's go, guys. Make sure to... Lucas, so we're supposed to remove spoiled berries for them to be buried properly. Pay Exploitation. <laughs> I don't think my tourist visa uh, allows me to work in this country, but <laughs> so I'm going to have you two pick. I'm not allowed. Okay, let's go, guys, before our people pick up all the good berries. I'm an illegal. They hiring here, Lucas. I think they will pay you in cash. <laughs> strawberries. Many people, I want to go back there. Too many strawberries here, guys. Did we start picking here or what? Not to the end. We have to walk there. All right, guys. So they gave us a white bucket. So if we see any spoiled strawberries, we're supposed to put them in here and give it back to them when we get out. Oh, how can I? How can you pull? 
right? Yes. Mmm. Yes, let's fill this bucket scored. up. You look literally like you're working at a farm on the farm. Oh, with my hat. Yeah. Free Asian labor. Flip flops. <laughs> Flip flops. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We just all agreed on not putting any of the spoiled strawberries in there because we don't work here, okay? Do not work here. This is for fun. All right, what are you doing down there, Lucas? I'm looking for good strawberries. Lots of these, are, they're still white. And I don't think they taste like anything if they're white, do they? Is the my entire like body is going to be aching after. From this <laughs> level, you can see there are many ripe strawberries. I'm getting my money somewhere. Remember to collect bad one too. Collect bad ones? Yes. I'm here to uh, enjoy myself, not to work. Ooh, well she got a lot already. Yeah. Guess what I got too, because I've been busy filming for you guys. You guys want to make a competition? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm already lost, okay? Already lost. <laughs> There's so many good ones here. And they're organic. Yes. Are they're, they organic? I guess so. so how, do you, how do we know they didn't spray anything? He's or filling up his box very quick. The jumbo ones are massive. They must be genetically modified. Picking strawberries makes me appreciate every strawberry that I buy in the grocery store. Quote by Annie. Ooh, Annie, what do you found? I found um, strawberries that were twins. Ooh, cute. It's, uh, siblings. Muta mu mutated strawberry. It shares one stem, cute. but it's two strawberries. You can sell it for a two thousand dollars. I got a really nice red big strawberry. That looks juicy. I'm nice. keeping that right here. And I don't know if I'm supposed to be here or not. Annie said I can't be here because I crossed the the the, the, the intersection or whatever. Crossed the wall. This one, this this area. Yeah, she he crossed it. But oh well. You're gonna stay there. I work here. What do you want? <laughs> How's the progress, my? Slowly, but steady. Slowly, but steady? She's yeah. the only one following the rules here. I would be fired if I were like picking strawberries on the street. You would be fired? I'd be fired. I think so, yeah. I think with me, they're gonna give me a second chance, but you both are definitely fired. Hi. <laughs> now, we did the same speed. Okay. We would all not survive here. We actually made this video back in June 2022, but because I have a full-time job as well, so it takes me a while to edit and release new videos. You look like a real farmer, Annie. I'm filming. Oh, She's pretty no, you're taking a photo. <laughs> I was trying to stand really still. That's all you get after an hour, Annie? Yeah. Unfortunately, you're fired. I know. No one would hire me. How about you? That's all you get after an hour? You're fired. But you only gave me this box. You How should can have. I do more? You have to put more into that bucket too. Oh, this is for the collecting. Yuck, the yucky ones. It's my work. That's all you did after one hour. Yeah, I'm the owner here. Still so many here, but we cannot overflow them. There's a theory why strawberries are called strawberries because people grow them with a layer of straw to help retain moisture, deter pests, and keep the berries cleaner. Hello. Hey. I'm filming. Oh, you are. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why she never. She that? never knows. I got my money's Oops. worth. Oh no, you that's dropped. that's a dollar right there that I dropped. Back in. <laughs> Hi. Hi, show us um, your masterpiece for the day. That's my masterpiece. You happy? Mm -hmm. I'll be even happier when I'm walking out of the sun now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go back, guys, to the farm. Yeah, we don't. Uh, I mean, to the barn. We don't want to turn into a strawberry. They smell very good, though. You're already kind of getting red. Yes. You're getting ripe. I'm wearing red <laughs> t shirt today to fit with this one. Oh, I wore orange. Orange, see? You got orange too. Pumpkin. You should pumpkin. go to pumpkin field, Lucas. <laughs> this one, you should go pick apple. Pick apples. Yes, apples. You have to pay me to pick apples. Well, at least you can pick them from trees. You don't have to bend down. Yeah, you have to crawl. I think they do That's that. True. I think they do that with machines. Shake the tree and then they fall off. In New England area, the strawberry season between early June to early July, and then cherries between June to mid July, and then apples between late August through late October. Hello. Hey. Okay, guys, let's go. Yes, let's left. get out. No, 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 wait. Back up. I go like through here, right? This one. No? Yes. Hey, we're filming. I am filming, yes. Okay, leave a comment in the section if you like going to the farm to pick produce. 
for fun. And you actually pay for it, though. And you pay for it. So we pay total fifty-four dollars for three people. Oh yeah, for these. Fifty-four dollars for. Um, these are golden strawberries. Yeah. Five kilos of strawberries. <laughs> five kilos of strawberries for you, European. Oh, we're, going we're supposed to go that I way. Like yeah. the barn with the kids. With the kids. But uh, they have fences over there, yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, a baby goat is a kid. What? A baby goat is called a kid. Oh, really? Kids. I think so. Oh, didn't know that. Oh, learn new word today. Yeah. No one uses it. I don't use it every day. Vocabulary for the day. Kid. What? Kid means baby goat. Means an hey, strawberry the field. strawberries smell very good, though. They smell very good. She just said that you barely smell them. I, I have to make my nose really close. To yeah, smell. you have to. You want to feed our audience one strawberry then? Feed our uh, audience? They're not washed yet. Ah. Uh. <laughs> so small. I small. have a nice one. Not like Ooh. the one in the. Ooh. So you can see it's almost the size of my head. Concept is very interesting. Do you guys think that you could apply this concept onto other businesses too? Like, hey, come and pay fifty dollars to work at an Amazon warehouse for a night shift, like that. I better be getting Amazon stuff. Yeah, Bellen. Yeah, Bellen. Guys, look at my pants. I had to knee down. Look at my pants. On the field. Clean. So right now it's very dirty. She's been wearing the perfect costume yeah. for the day. My yeah. ancestors told me to wear this. Are they birds? What kind of birds are they? They've been walking around the farm and they, they might chase you too if you approach them. They look like turkeys actually. If anyone knows what kind of bird they are, feel free to leave a comment below. Let me try this strawberry. Very soft to bite into. Very soft? Is it sweet? Sweet and a little bit sour, which I like. So out of 10, how are you gonna rate it? 10 out of 10, right? Because you actually handpicked it. I handpicked it. I put my blood, sweat, and tears into it. And it just tastes even that much better. I'm so proud of Annie. She actually handpicked the strawberries. <laughs> okay, guys, after waiting for Annie's and Lucas. Hey, hi, That's hi, Lucas. <laughs> hi, Lucas. Okay, let's go check out the farm store and see how much they sell per box of strawberries. They might not even sell strawberries. Really? Are you but sure? But we will, we will see. Okay, let's go guys. Let's okay go. guys, actually we are trying to sell box. the strawberry to the store. Alright, let's go inside. I do. Okay, let's go. Thank you, Annie. Oh, they are selling strawberries here too. They look very big. Well, how much, how much per box, Lucas? Ten dollars and they're about... Half of ours. Did we save some money then? No, not at all. Including gas money, no. <laughs> These are the most expensive strawberries on. Our knees too. Could have just went straight to the store. Oh, they sell honey here. Hot honey. Hot honey. They add chili like in it. I don't know why hot honey. Raw wildflower honey. I used to eat this. Oh, you used to eat those? Yeah, it's a dumb idea. I thought it would make me smarter. Sprinkle it on yogurt. This is ice cream. I, I see what they look like, but I've never seen it in real life. Yeah, that's how it looks like in real life. Can you show an audience? You know, yeah. if you want to do a fun activity, you can do beekeeping. <laughs> okay. Well, you need some equipment for that, though. Well, I'm sure they'll provide you with the protective gear. <laughs> sure. And with the smoke to calm them down. Let's do it. So this is pure calm honey. Yes. Boston Honey Company. Guys, 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 remember you have to follow those rules. Be humble, be honest, be kind, be positive, be grateful, be happy, and be you. Be you. Boston University. Be you. Be you. Boston University. <laughs> they have fresh fresh here. To be honest with you, I did not know about this kind of candy until I moved to the US and apparently it was invented in America during the late 19th century. It is made of sugar, butter, and milk. You mix them together, you heat them up to the softball stage, and then you beat the mixture while it cools to get the creamy and smooth texture. And it looks pretty much like brownie to me, which is another American dessert. We just each of us washed a strawberry and now we're gonna try it. I got this big juicy one. I got this nice one. yours. Okay, cheers. And uh, we'll take this one off. Four. Man, I just leave it on like that. Strawberry cheers. Cheers. Taylor strawberry. Tastes like a strawberry. Yeah. Strawberry that you can buy at the store or yes. you just handpicked it from the ground. Not, not very sweet though. Not too sweet, yeah. Like um sour. A little bit sour, yeah. Great. <laughs> and how does this compare to a German Ich Belly? 
I could just compare that one. It's it's less sweet but good. More 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 water. I think like more juicy compared to the one in Germany. That was a small sample size. We cannot draw a conclusion. From that. <laughs> okay. It's not very scientific. <laughs> All right, but at the end, is it the best? Because we can pick them. They're ours. I'm gonna go wash my hands again. Action! I know Action. exactly where we're gonna go. Where are we gonna go? We're gonna go to Egg Roll Lady in Worcester. And what is that? It's a Vietnamese like little shack that sells like egg rolls. Egg rolls and also like fried, fried egg fried stuff that you find at the beach. So it is in Worcester. Okay, let's go to Worcester then That's guys. Close, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, we have the trash can here because it's a farm so even the trash area looks very fancy with wooden thing wooden board let's go let's go let's go let's go we have to make sure to park somewhere in the shade otherwise we're gonna have strawberry juice today we can cook jelly like a telephone booth right in london okay, no okay let's go to the car or strawberry gonna have to turn bad okay guys right now we're walking around the parking lot to find my car i don't remember where i parked oh actually i think i saw it right oh, here, here. Okay. where are we going next annie we're going to worcester to uh look for other vietnamese people stay tuned so we're figuring out what these trees are i i said they look like olive trees to me you can zoom in and there's some agreement no, on that look number three look is it and Mai's talking in the video? Yeah. This lady? They look like olive trees to me, yeah. But this is not really Mediterranean climate, is it? Okay, we're on our way to Worcester now. In another dimension where Mai has her own farm, the ad of the farm will look like this. One, two, three, one, two, three. <coughs> test, test. Okay, welcome to Mice Farm, guys. Today we're joined by two of our interns. We're gonna pick a sample size strawberry amount to see whether they're good yet. Here's me picking one. Here's the boss picking one. Of course, help by the intern. And here's one of our best workers in her designated work uniform. Can we pick that? It's good enough to pick it. Some of them are not ripe yet. We will leave those for later. They need some more sun. Here's the other intern. The boss has picked two strawberries so far. And here's this gentleman. Looking through the leaves, skimming through. Always both eyes open. And here's the boss again. What is she doing? She's picking up one as well as a bug. Ew. Makes me appreciate every strawberry that I buy in the grocery store. Mice farm with love. Ooh. Got a really nice red big strawberry. Hard labor in the sun for me, though I'm unpaid because I'm not as fast yet. Here's the boss, giving us a helping hand. And here's one of the real pickers. They are very experienced in picking the best strawberries in a reasonable time. Happy laborers at Mai's family farm. Hello! Only at this farm a wee family. Look at these juicy ones. Mmm. These are golden strawberries. Yes. Sampling time. Only at my farm we meet world quality standard. And is it the best? Because we can pick them. Check. Hello guys, welcome to our strawberry review section today. Mm -hmm. So we have two bowls right here. This is the one we picked from my farm. And these are the ones we bought from the store. Try the store ones first, yes. They're looking juicy. They're not. Mm -mm. Sour? Very sour. Ooh. Okay, and then I'm gonna move on to juicy strawberries from my farm. Those are really red. I we'll suggest you take this one. Alright, so this is the one that my cameraman chose for me. Mmm. Better? Better. Juicy and sweet. They make your face smile. Yes. <laughs> I'm ready to go to work now without eating breakfast. Our wonderful garden is a plant plot of land used to cultivate new plants, flowers, and fruits and trees and other forms of nature. 